four-way action coming up in Byron. What should we look out for in this one? This is one of those matches, Michael, where anything can happen, and it usually does. The only thing I know for sure is that the referee will have his hands full in this one. Some are saying he's in the best shape of his career right now. Would you agree with that, Corey? It's hard not to agree with that statement, Cole. I mean, just look at him. I'll tell you, he's going to be tough to beat, that's for sure. swinging too much to his side. This match is underway, and this WI team episode is underway. The Welcome to episode number 59. We have a, a fatal four way action between way. four men who can and the match unfortunately can came up short in the Cruiserweight Championship tournament, suicide. but a win here in a fatal four way match in the main event of this edition of 205 Live Direct could go a long hit. way to improving their standing on the rankings. 
This is a fatal four way, no disqualification, no Here count out match. And a newcomer right to now. NXT, Buddy Murphy and Andrew, fighting it out on the outside of the ring. Mustafa Ali and Cedric Alexander fighting out inside, but Murphy and Andrew will join them inside the ring. Something's going to have to give here, Michael. Murphy with a stop to the elbow of Andrew. And Murphy forces Andrew to his feet, but Andrew reverses into a slam. making his presence felt there. Elbow drop from Andrew. He goes for cover. And the elbow drop hits. And Murphy's got power out at one. Mustafa we'll Ali looking to take flight with a beautiful moonsault yeah, to the outside of the ring on Cedric Alexander. He's struggling a bit here. And at this point, Round up with strikes from Andrew. Andrew also Nothing looking to take flight. And Ali just taking it too. Cedric Alexander it outside. When guys go out there. Things are going to heat up now, fellas. I don't know. He just seems a little intimidated. Andrew from forces the start. Murphy to and his feet. Looking for a DDT, but way. there's a reversal from Buddy Murphy. Now forces no, Andrew no into a, a slam there. The Murphy with Andrew into the, into the corner. The Mustafa Ali now in the ring now. He'll He's go back outside the fight. Here. Cedric Gobbs and be careful. Three Murphy guys in there with looking for a diving axe handle and couldn't he tell really if that hit or not. Point, All four men now in the cold, ring. But he's got to be careful not to take too much more punishment here. Now it's Murphy and Andrew fighting it out this is inside the ring. Ali and Alexander outside. To the pressure, but I wouldn't expect Reversal by Andrew. His perseverance will Andrew looking to get here. to a 2-2 so and two record with a big victory here in a fatal four-way match. Andrew with a running slam into the corner right and then now. a running You've power slam. Find a way to get out of this, Michael. Andrew goes for cover. And Murphy's gonna power out a one. Looking for the quick pin and the kick out. Oh man, I don't know who to root for. Murphy, formerly part of NXT, where he was He's part of a popular tag team attack. and stable called BAMF with Wesley Blake and Alexa Bliss. And he makes it to the Andrew now turns his attention to Mustafa Ali head. with Alexander wow, and Murphy down. You guys are. Going that after the lay. That forces Ali to a seated injuries. position. Now to a knee. Here's a strike from Andrew and a DDT. All three men He's down now for Andrew. Him. Andrew's looking for that, that flat line. Here. The unfortunate reality is he might not get up, which wouldn't shock me one bit. Flat line connects to Mustafa Ali. Oh man, what a nasty STO. But there's Cedric Alexander no, before Andrew can point. follow it up with a pin. Murphy on the outside. Coming. Reversal from Alexander. Doesn't show any signs of getting up Suplex here, guys. by Cedric no, Alexander, but he's the one standing with a can. That's Cedric Alexander capitalized. What force? Alexander. Just to the apron. What's he have in mind there. here? There's a springboard. Rock splash by Alexander. Out. Now you Ali is going to go after him. Right now. Ain't no stopping him now. Ali's going to turn attention back to Buddy Murphy as Cedric Alexander works the arm of Andrew. All four men now oh, in the that ring. Was unreal. Ali's going to go for cover on Buddy Murphy. And Murphy's going to power Shepard's out. Andrew forced to the apron. He's a long way from a three count, I can tell you that. Just needs to do more damage. Alexander biding his time now pulls Andrew down. And he lands a nice counter outside the ring. Andrew pays for that ramming one. his knee into the ankle of Cedric oh, Alexander, trying to neutralize the last beat and agility of Alexander. Low kick to Alexander. Watch out! There's the drop kick. Andrew wants to get back into the Here ring. There's an Irish whip. Back in from the floor with such authority. Here's his chance. Not where he wants to Andrew be. Andrew right forces Alexander to receive position, but Murphy now when you're down. going after Andrew. Neutralizes him with an elbow. Huge spike DDT by Andrew. That's going to send Buddy Murphy to the Just outside. This, man. Andrew turned like attention to Cedric Alexander. There's a stump pull. Andrew forces He's Alexander up. Andrew, rolling right knee bar locked in. But Alexander's going to get out of that pretty quickly. Justin now Andrew turns on to the last man standing. Mustafa Ali 
Definitely I'm sure he's some big kicks, and that's what's going to all lead to the outside. Ali, you're getting to look a little weak out here. He's definitely Edgar starting Taker to feel the pressure of this fatal four-line match. Focusing on Derek Alexander, but I'm really he gets a reversal. What we're seeing from him Marty Murphy tonight. back in, in the ring now. I really thought he had a chance of winning this fatal four-way match. Now, I'm not Alexander so sure Alexander wants he's Andrew on his feet, but Murphy on the attack. This capacity Alexander goes for the diving elbow drop regardless. Murphy going for a dirty pin. This is an incredible... Will this be... And that's going to be broken up by Cedric Alexander. All four men, and once again, the ring. Stop Ali. Look at take flight. Oh, uh, this is dangerous right here. He wants this Andrew on his feet. Him, Byron. Well, if he can't get back to his feet, Andrew avoids right. the drop kick. Huge two handed bulldog by Andrew. Big miss for him there. And a likely pick. Also by Mustafa Ali. Oh, boy, he is rolling. ET by Andrew. Andrew's thinking flat line. Today. For a second time Maybe in this match, it's devastating, and that will back connect. Inside the ring, he's bringing it back inside the Andrew ring. Andrew goes for cover. His signature slam. This one and is Ali powers out at right two. He is a one man gang in there. Andrew stomping to the chest of Ali. It's like someone hit There's the another stomp. This move. Oh, and he reverses it. And Andrew, single arm and leg locked him to stop Ali. It's locked in well. It's going to lead to a victory for Andrew. Yes, it will. Ali is going to tap to the single arm and leg lock. Andrew picks up a huge victory and a fatal fall away. And Andrew back at 500 with a victory. He now holds a record of 2-2 two and two in the universe here. despite absorbing a huge amount of punishment there. There's few things more humiliating than tapping out to your opponent. What a thrilling main event. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us. Have a great night. Okay, and here are your results for 205 Live. TJP defeated Dewa Tommy in the first of our semifinal matches for the Cruiserweight Championship Tournament. Lindsay Dorado is going to advance to the Cruiserweight Championship match at Greatest Royal Rumble. His opponent will be the Brian Kendrick. So, Lindsay Dorado versus Brian Kendrick. For the vacant Cruiserweight Championship in the Cruiserweight Championship Tournament Finals at Grace Royal Rumble is confirmed. Drew Gulak defeated Grand Metalik. And Andrew Spud Strong defeated Mustafa Ali with no decision for Buddy Murphy and Cedric Alexander. So now, how does that affect the rankings on 205 Live? Let's find out. Drake Mavic is the placeholder of Cruiserweight Champion until we crown a new champion at Grace Royal Rumble. As of right now, the rankings look like this. Number one, Cedric Alexander. Number two, Drew Gulak. Number three, Akira Tozawa. Number four, TJP. Number five, Lince Dorado. Number six, Brian Kendrick. Number seven, Hideo Otami. Number eight, Tony Nice. Number nine, Jack Gallagher. Number ten, Andrew Spudstrong. He jumps up five spots. Number eleven, Mark Andrews. Number twelve, Graham Metalik. Number thirteen, Ari Davari. Number 14, Mustafa Ali. Number 15, Kalisto. And number 16, Buddy Murphy. So now we move on to NXT. And we are not going to have a WITM match on that card. And so we will sim. I'll be back in a moment with your results and rankings update for NXT. All right, here are your results for NXT. Nikki Cross defeated Ember Moon. That is a non-title victory. Cassia Sona defeated Bobby Fish. No decision for Cesar Bononi. Sanity defeated TM61. Ricochet defeated Johnny Gargano. Larry Sullivan, Leo Rush, Eric Young, Tommaso Ciampa, Velveteen Dream, and Fabian Eichner in a eight-man over-top rope battle royal. 
Undisputed Era, represented by Kyle O'Reilly and Roderick Strong, defeated War Raiders. And Adam Cole, the North American champion, defeated EC3 in non title action. And how did that affect the rankings on NXT? Let's find out. And Bermoon is NXT Women's Champion. Number one contender, Bianca Belair. Number two, Aaliyah. Number three, Dakota Kai. Number four, Lacey Evans. Number five, Nikki Cross. Number six, Shayna Baszler. Number seven, Vanessa Bourne. Number eight, Kyrie Sane. And number nine, Candice LeRae. In the tag team division, the champions are Sanity. Number one contenders, Heavy Machinery. Number two, War Raiders. Number three, TM61. Number four, Mustache Mountain. Number five, Moss and Sabatelli. And number six, Street Profits. In the North American Championship rankings, the champion is Adam Cole, baby. Number one, Cash Sono. Number two, EC3. Number three, Velveteen Dream. Number four, Cesar Bononi. Number five, Ricochet. Number six, Leo Rush. Number seven, Lars Sullivan. Number eight, Fabian Eichner. And the NXT champion is Oni Lorcan. Number one contender, Adam Cole, baby. Number two, Cash Sono. Number three, Johnny Gargano. Number four, Aleister Black. And number five, Tommaso Ciampa. And our next episode, it is time for the Greatest Royal Rumble. It is pay-per-view time, our first pay-per-view in the new universe year. Now, Andrew and I decided that for all pay-per-views, we will be doing the same match types that they do in real out the real life version of pay per view from now on, since we are pretty close to the real life WWE calendar. We are in week four of April in our universe calendar, or the end of week three. And of course, in real life, it is the first week of May at the time of this recording. So we will be having the same match types that had the Greatest Royal Rumble, such as a four man ladder match for the Intercontinental Championship and a steel cage match for the Universal Championship. So I'm going to edit the card off screen. I'll be back in a moment to show you the card for the Greatest Royal Rumble co-branded pay-per-view featuring superstars from Raw, SmackDown, and 205 Live. I'll be back in just a moment with your Greatest Royal Rumble card. Okay, here is your card for Greatest Royal Rumble. Now I'll have to do this on two separate saves. I, so I have the non-title matches on one save and the title matches on the other. Here is your non-title matches. We did the two non-title matches are on the real life card. We have John Cena versus Triple H as well as The Undertaker with versus Rusev accompanied by Aiden English and then the Greatest Royal Rumble itself. I'm not quite sure I'm going to mention the 50-man rumble yet but I will figure something out. And then on the other save, just bear with me one moment. We have our title matches, starting with the finals of the Cruiserweight Championship Tournament. Lindsay Dorado takes on Brian Kendrick to crown a new Cruiserweight Champion. Then we have a Raw Tag Team Championship match. The Raw Tag Team Champions, the Revival, defend against the new tag team of Dolph Ziggler and Drew McIntyre. Then John Cena defends the United States Championship of the, against Xavier Woods of New Day, accompanied by the rest of New Day, Kofi Kingston and Big E. Then we have our first of two WITM matches on the Greatest Royal Rumble card. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me again. The Shield defending the SmackDown Tag Team Championships against Sheamus and Cesaro, the Bar, newcomers to the SmackDown Tag Team Division, the Bar, former Raw Tag Team Champions. Then we have our Fatal 4-Way ladder match for the Intercontinental Championship. Bobby Roode defends against Bobby Lashley, Mike Kanellis, and No Way Jose. Then we have Kane. He's a member of Monday Night Raw, but still appears on SmackDown Live while he is the WWE Champion. Will Randy Orton send Kane permanently 
packing to Monday Night Raw, ending his time on SmackDown and becoming the WWE Champion. And in the main events, it's going to be the Universal Champion, Kevin Owens, defending the Universal Championship inside of a steel cage against the monster among men, Braun Strowman. So there is your greatest Royal Rumble card. Two WIT matches. We have, again, the Shield of being the SmackDown Tag Team Championships against the Bar. And we will have all four WIT members in action in the 50-man Greatest Royal Rumble match. So we will see you in Episode 64, Greatest Royal Rumble, our first pay-per-view of the New Universe year. Until then, this is Corey with WIT and Kyle Wrestling, signing off.